Hi, welcome back to my channel. Friends and loved ones of Hollywood socialite Nicole Murphy are reportedly mourning the loss of her boyfriend, Warren Braithwaite, who died from cancer. The news began circulating March 2nd, after two of Braithwaite's friends shared a post about him online. Despite not addressing his demise publicly, Murphy has since disabled the comment section of her Instagram posts, some of which feature intimate moments the couple shared including them, dancing at a party in December, and during a New Year's Eve party and at her birthday party. In one of the videos, from those happier days, she can be seen winding and grinding on her man. The duo at one point seems to be in their own world, dancing on the dance floor amongst the crowd. At the holiday party, the two joined friends and are seen celebrating life and sharing their love through a series of kisses. These were some of the last times Murphy shared content with them on her page. The public became informed of Braithwaite's death as his friends started to post tributes on social media on March 2nd. One person wrote, Lost a good friend, a brother, a childhood friend today, Imma miss you like a mother fuka. Imma missed the two-hour phone calls laughing and talking shit with the money we made together over years partying the bottle wars in the club. You was a good dude. I don't give a fuck what nobody has to. Say about you. You was always a giving person, never selfish or greedy. Sharing and caring was your motto. This one hurts so fucking bad. Adding, but we're gonna celebrate your life way over the top cause that's who you wear. Rest easy. Love you bro fuck cancer. Nikki Murphy stay strong sister. Another one of Braithwaite's loved ones posted a tribute to him in their Instagram story, further noting how generous and selfless he was. My nigger never shined on niggers he always wanted shine with his niggers. If you didn't have it, he would go the extra mile to make sure we all looked good when we step out. A lot of y'all niggers don't have. A clue what it is to have a team but when niggers wanna tear your head off you, wanna remember real niggers rest in peace to a real, the man wrote. He also revealed that Braithwaite gave him 30k, took him to dinner and shopping after he came home from jail. If I could have saved your life one more time, King, the person concluded with several crying emojis. Little is known about how Braithwaite obtained his wealth, with some sources saying he owns a construction company in Los Angeles. While Murphy kept details about her love out of the public's eye, the two have been romantically linked since she first shared photos of them on her Instagram last July. In one flick posted in her stories, Braithwaite is seen looking off to the side with her lying on his chest. The post was complimented by Daniel Caesar's track, Best Part, featuring H.E.R. Murphy wrote, He's so serious, over the image with a lovey-dovey emoji. The couple were also photographed with Murphy's ex-husband, comedian Eddie Murphy, at her son, Miles Murphy's wedding in September 2023. Both men wore dark shades as she smiled in a pink satin dress between the two. The Hollywood ex's star had her arms around each man's waist, but her hip was clearly positioned toward her current man's direction, signifying who her affections were for. A month ago, around during the Super Bowl weekend, the former model was seen with Braithwaite at the doo-wop all R&B soul music day party with singers Tank, Nayo and Mario in Las Vegas, Nevada, according to Getty Images. Outside of his friend's reference to his cancer, details surrounding his death or his battle with the disease are unknown. However, people did say that he looked well until the end. He never looked sick in all his pictures, one person said, before reiterating what many have said. This is too sad for Nicole and his family. A third added, this is so sad. She looked so happy when she was with him. May he rest in peace. From what the mother of five posted online, they seemed madly in love. In December 2023, she wrote, We both are not perfect, but we are perfect for each other, my love. 